From the dawn of time, the Wolfson family has always taken the idea of the pack very seriously. Rituals of binding members together are bloody and sacred. But more unforgiving are the ones that break that bond. All that matters is who is in the family and who is out. My father has always been a fervent believer in the family lore. You are part of the family, my family. Now hold still, son. Now and forever, I bind you to the wolf. He was a very hard man to live with. You don't just walk away from being a Wolfson. Yet 20 years ago, that's just what I did. And now, I have to go home. We about done here, that storm's getting close. That's very funny, Michael, because from the amount of help that you offered, I thought you wanted to get wet. I don't know the first thing about fixing stuff. Only breaking it. I know. I told you this trip was a shitty idea. Hey, I take no responsibility for that. I don't know what happened, and Brandon, no one asked you. Oh, I cannot get in here and get enough leverage on this wrench. Hey, bring your big man arms over here. Didn't you just mention I was good at breaking stuff? <sighs> yeah, well, sometimes you're good in a clinch. Come on. I just, I need you to just really tighten that right there. Okay, I got it. should be good. I don't know how that even came off. The tensioner was still on. There. What are you yeah. looking at? I did it right, right? Yeah, I think so. Can I have my ring back? Romantic. I'm gonna piss. Michael. What? Don't be so nervous. I'm not nervous. I just don't understand why this is so important to you. It's your family, Michael. My family is not like yours. Doesn't matter. Family's family. Right, because you're the one who said, he's your nephew, Michael. You gotta take him in. Uh... You were right. It's only one weekend. We can make it through one weekend. Just, I'm trying to be supportive. Go where I'm leaving. That's pretty much what you said. And I don't know, it just seems like you're real eager to make nice with the old fart that holds the family purse strings. Jesus, Brandon, what did you do? Nothing. Didn't do anything. I mean, look at that. Hey, don't, don't touch me. Brandon, let her take a look at it. It was a tree branch. All right, I said I'm fine. I don't need you playing mom. Let's go. I just want you to know that your little trust fund has nothing to do with how I feel. It's the only reason I stick around.
more you hit, the more points you get. So you're trying to hit them. Yep, I'm a good driver. <laughs> Welcome to the Wolfson family compound. You grew up here? Yep. It's a little more high-tech than I remember, but just as homey. It's beautiful grounds, but what's with all the security? What's he so afraid of? <laughs> Being alone. Uh, he's been busy. Wow. for a fun-filled weekend. That must be Annabelle. Oh, how'd you get in here? You need to leave. Get off my property. Gary, I let them in. Calm down. Go say hello to your son, Gary. Junior? It's Michael. Oh boy, is that you? Look at you. I'm sorry. For everything. But you're here now, and we're all together. You, and me, and Chloe. That's Juliet, Dad. My girlfriend. Your fiancé, actually. It's nice to meet you. Mint. They say if you keep it in your pocket, it's just a superstition. But if you're gonna be part of the family, we'll want to take care of you. Let's get her in. Well, wait. Brandon, come here. Dad, this is Brandon. You look just like her. Just like her. The eyes, it's uncanny. Maybe it's the eyeliner. What the hell are you waiting for? Get their bags. It's my son. He's home at last. Well, I'll get him. Brandon. What's with all of this? Oh, what? You don't like my decorations? <laughs> we should have a toast.
nothing there, Dad. Well, we all shouldn't just stand around out here. Still like scotch, right? Michael, I'm sure you know where your room is. Welcome home, present. These have good mojo. So glad you're home, son. Now you go to your room and put your things away, and I'll tell you the good news. I have news. Good eye. My latest addition. What is it? An eyeball. A camera. Military issue. Military issue. What the hell do you think's gonna happen in your living room, for God's sakes, Dad? It's a little bit of overkill, don't you think? To homecomings. Leopard. That's hot. Hey. You want to make out on your tiny bed? You know what changed my mind? I think this is going to be fun. Well, at least the first thing that he said was, I'm sorry. No, sorry. He does not get off that easy. Not after what he did to us. Michael, what is this? That is my high school diploma. Chloe and I were homeschooled, and she made it for me. Why does it say that your name is Garrison Michael Wolfson? Am I marrying a Gary? No. You are not. Don't forget to wear your PJs. I don't know if I got them all. Michael, you. He's watching. Good. I was coming to talk to you. Intercom has been on the fritz lately. Can I have a minute? Oh, of course. Brandon is. Brandon. I'm sorry. Take your time. I'll be unpacked in a second. I'm sorry. 
I didn't know what else to do. I'm in one guest room and the other. It's just a little weird, that's all. It's kind of girly, but I'm fine. Okay, if you're sure. You can come in if you want. I don't know how you live without iPods. It was her favorite. Chloe said it reminded her of mom. Dad hated it. Saw you had a guitar in your room. I didn't know you knew how to play. Not well, why? Well, if you want to learn, you should ask Gary. He's really good. Or at least he used to be. I don't know why you talk so much shit about Gary. He's weird, but he's cool. You should try living with him. Anything to get me out of your place? You should cover that. This is what I wanted to talk to you about. What is this? His panic room. I think panic too with all this crazy shit in my house. The passcode is your birthday. My birthday. I'm sure you remember. God knows, by the time you left, you'd already amassed a compound. But now, Michael, the doctor says he's stuck in some kind of rut, mentally. His memory comes and goes, but security is a constant obsession. After Chloe's, after her murder, started going downhill fast, Michael. Progressive dementia. What's with all this stuff? Protection. Against what? Good taste? Evil. Spirits who mean harm. These symbols are meant to keep them at bay. They don't like their own reflection? So what else does the doctor say? Have you talked to Gary about what he ultimately wants? A home? Oh, he gets very upset. Sometimes he thinks... I'm your mother. Has he... Fine. But I do need to ask for help with your father. I can't do it anymore, Michael. You don't stay on at the house, right? I appreciate that. But no. This house. This house is too full. It's yours. I just want to go. That's where you go. Right. Well, I'll, uh, wrap my head around it, and, uh, we'll both talk to him in the morning. I'm sorry. No, I, uh, I get it. 
This is insanity. I know. Who's insane? Uh, this great new room improvement. Command Central used to be a desk and a couple of monitors. Well, home protection has come a long way in 20 years. And I am impressed. Yes, well, I have microphones and cameras to cover the entire estate and house. And motion detecting infrared, EMPs, night vision, and ultra wideband radar. Nothing can hide from these babies. You care to explain these? This is a very special place, son. It requires very special protection. Yeah. Maybe one day you'll understand that. And now maybe my wife will stop trespassing in my private zone, and you and I can have that drink. And you can tell me that news. News? Make sure all the windows are closed tonight. I'm gonna make some tea. Anyone else? Here, let me show you a song. Since when do you play? Never practiced. He was lazy. hard. Best one's off. Chloe likes that one. She did. Reminded her of mom. Whoa. With all of Gary's security, I seriously doubt that any... Garrison Michael Wolfson. Did you break my cup? I found it in the cupboard in pieces. You see? It's like he's just... gone. Music! That's what we need! Mind you, old hag, I wanted to dance with a young, beautiful thing anyway. Oh, uh, no, I am not much of a dancer. Well, come here and let me teach you. <laughs> yep. Michael, you remember our dance nights? Chloe loves to dance. She would twirl the night away. You'd twirl the night away. Well, if you hadn't been such a party pooper since birth, he's always so sour. I don't see what you see in him. I'll tell you what I do remember. I remember you beating the shit out of Chloe for spilling her milk on the carpet. Gary? Perhaps we should just go on to bed. Gary, perhaps it's time to say goodnight. How many times have I told you, Beverly? 
Do not question me in front of the kids. Enough, Gary. I am the man of the house. Enough. That's right. Enough. I'm calling my niece first thing in the morning. Go to bed, Gary. But Beverly! This isn't Beverly. This is your new wife, Annabelle, and she's leaving in the morning. Just like Mom left you several years ago. And if you touch her again, I swear to God. Looks like we're staying a little longer. Annabelle? Yes, dear? I, I just wanted to say that whatever it is you need, we'll do. Your family. I'd be careful about using that word in this house, if I were you. Well, regardless, the sentiment remains the same. Of course. I know what you mean. And I appreciate it. Good night. Good night, dear. Sound is really annoying. Yeah. Hush. People are trying to sleep. Oh, thank God. I wonder if it's from the storm.
<laughs> you almost did. Okay. It's just a bad dream. I don't blame you either. Tonight was totally crazy. Sorry, no pun intended. I'm really sorry I've been pushy lately. You haven't been pushy. No, I have. I was getting you to set dates and stuff when you're just clearly not... I'm clearly what? Well, you just, you've got a lot of stuff going on. With Chloe and Brandon. And William and now your dad. I promise I'll back off. Uh, don't back off. I don't want to lose you, too. Yeah? Then let's hope that surly teenager doesn't send me screaming from the house. <laughs> You know I'm not with you for the money, right? Yeah, I know. I was just angry. <laughs> oh. What was that? He was out there! I saw him! He pushed me and I fell! Look! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Calm down. Alright? There was no one out there, you just tripped and fell. Okay? Jesus, Dad, give me that! You could seriously hurt someone! What does he want? He's always so much worse when he's tired. You, you gotta believe me! You can't go around shooting off firearms and nothing! The cameras, they... I went out to investigate. He was out there! I saw him! Gary, let Annabelle get you some clean pajamas, okay? I will go see. Michael? Yeah. You're not wearing your necklace. That mine's all broken. Is this new? It looks old. I, I don't know. I, I, I've never seen it. What the hell happened? Dad, it's bedtime, okay? It's bedtime. You always like story, Dad. We had some good times, didn't we? Yes.
you doing? What are you doing? You're bleeding. What did you do? Glass cut my foot. Shit, you want me to see if there's any like a piece in there? Yeah. No, you're right. You're right. That's a bad idea. I don't really like feet. Okay, if I sleep out here. Room getting to you? The room and the cameras. The crazy guy in the halls. Pick that up, will you? What is this? Antique family records. What language is this? That is Old Norse. No shit. No shit. You come from Vikings. Gary was busy with that shit my whole childhood. Sat up at night reading and translating. That's where he came up with this brilliant idea. Thought you were gonna hit him. Glad you didn't. Waited my whole life for that moment. Planned it out. Maybe I should have hit him for mom. It's different when it's an old guy. Yeah, apparently. Did he hit your mom too? Oh yeah, often. Then he made me watch her die. No, not like that. Actually, he wouldn't let me see her for years after she left. When I was 15 and I had a choice, I went to live with mom. Soon after that, she got her cancer diagnosis. She didn't have a penny for treatment or meds. And here he sat, holed up with millions of dollars of family fortune. Not like he was spending it, right? She left us when he did that. Yeah. Mom said it was to keep you guys together. <laughs> oh, yeah, and it did. Right up until I had a choice. A little over two years after that, Mom was dead. Right before my 18th birthday. That's your mom. He eats away at me sometimes. Chloe did love dad. Somehow she was always able to forgive him. Give him a second chance. How could she end up with another guy that beats her? She wasn't stupid, Brandon. She was duped. Sometimes you just go with what you know. Get some rest, kiddo.
almost noon. You've been out here all night. Uh, yeah. <sighs> I have to admit that double bed does sleep a lot better without you. Your dad snoring finally woke me up, though. I bet. I have a feeling he's gonna be up for a while if we just let him sleep. Could you make some coffee? I don't know where the coffee pot is. It's in the kitchen. Annabelle's in there. Come on. Today's still the day? Michael. Please don't think I don't love him. I wish my mom would have left years earlier. You go. We got this. I'm gonna have the first waffle. Oh, you're such a jerk. Do you want it? Mm -hmm. Pinky, Brandon. Pinky. Morning, Junior. Don't call me that. And it's afternoon. Juliet, hey. my dance partner. How could I forget? We all sitting in the dark. Shit. Hey, can I go check out that tree house out front? I just want to see where you and Mom hung out. Fine, but be careful. I think I saw a ladder in the garage. Put on a jacket. There you are. It's just looking for you. Do you yeah. mind? No. I, um, I put some things in your luggage. I don't want Carrie to find them. Like what? <sighs> Keys. With some instructions. Passcodes. Bank information. Stuff like that. Okay. Do you mind? <sighs> Not at all, of course. <laughs> Partners in crime here. <laughs> Annabelle, tell me something. The way Gary treats you, why did you stay so long? You know, I ask myself the same question. But honey, love is enduring. I do love Gary. And I can see you love Michael very much. Yeah, I do. He loves you.
How much did Gary tell you about Chloe and William? Tell me what he knew. Chloe and William, they were married for, for a while and he was very abusive and everybody knew it, but everybody kept quiet. You're, you're so weak! Do you understand? You hurt my son! One day he just lost it on Brandon and he broke his arm badly. It was a bone poking through. And finally, Michael, you know, he had enough and he just said, you have to leave him. So she did and she came to live with us. But uh, a couple days later, William broke into our house and he stabbed her. And there's Brandon. He hates me. Just scratches, I'm fine. That's been happening to you an awful lot lately. What did you do? He didn't, he didn't do anything. What does this look like to you? No. No, Michael. Don't touch him. Not him. Not ever. Watch him. But it wasn't me.
there's been an accident. I wonder... Actually, I was wondering about the security footage. Do you guys keep... Yeah. Hello? Hello? I'm sorry, Gary. But there, there are some things I just can't accept. That I just can't live with. There you go. You stay safe, my darling. He isn't telling you everything. And when he does, it will sound crazy. I may have gone a little crazy myself to believe it. You need to tell them everything. You need to tell them. They have a right to know. It isn't safe to keep it from them. And whatever you decide, my dear, decide it with Annabelle. Michael! What are you doing? Oh my God. What is this place? I thought there might be a manual switch or some way I could restart the server in here. I don't know how he's doing this. Annabelle is leaving. Right now? Yeah, and she was talking about something that Gary is not telling us that sounds very important. So you need to come. Is there a niece here? I don't know, I came to find you. Shit. I know, right? Where's Gary? I, I don't know. I lost him. He was there one moment and then he was gone. I, I think I might have a concussion. I'm seeing things. Well, is Annabelle gone? I don't know. What do you mean you might have a concussion?
Get it. Hey. Hey, um, is Aunt Annabelle ready? Yeah. I'm Brandon. Christine. <laughs> nice to meet you. Um, so what happened here last night? We should go inside. Okay. Where are you in? Hi. Um, I'm, I'm so sorry I'm late. Is Annabelle ready? I, I saw her bags outside. I just... Are you Christine? Yeah. Uh, we thought that she was already with you. With, with me. But I, I just, I just got here. Did you guys see this? Seen what? You guys got TP or something. I hate to tell you this, but they let the air out of your tires, too. Oh my god. I changed my mind. Let's find Annabelle and go in Christine's car. I'll come back with the authorities for dad once I get you guys into town. Wait, my car? What's going on, you guys? I really gotta get going. Look, right now we just really need to find your aunt. Michael, where do you think she could have even gone? What is it? Go inside. Michael, what is it? What happened? Hey, is it my aunt? Is she all right? No. No, no, no. no What's no, going no, on? No, no, no. Brent, don't. Oh. It's just like when he went apeshit on us at home. All right, it's a game with him. He's gonna draw us out. What do we do? I don't know. Yeah, he's fucking playing with us. I don't get it. How is he here? It was him at the treehouse. All right, I think I saw him whenever the car broke down. I saw mom too. Where? Is he gone? No.
Who the hell is on my property? William, Chloe's husband. My dad. But how did he get through my wards? That stuff isn't real, Dad. Neither are ghosts, I guess you'd say. I seem to recall my precaution saving your ass out there. Uh. Hey. 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 I can barely move my arm. Oh, my head is... You just hit your head, that's all. Let's get to the panic room. Come on, honey, let's go. Okay. You're saying Chloe's been trapped here this whole time. You called me insane. The next words out of my mouth were not going to be, your dear departed sister is living with me. And while I'm truly sorry, I'm glad too. Because I'm losing my mind. You see, it's going faster than I'd like to admit, pieces at a time. But now I know that after I die, no, after we die, we'll all come back together, here. That's impossible. Michael, please tell me that you are not believing this. I didn't take it completely seriously all those years ago. Truth be known, I was just an angry drunk with too much time on my hands. But our family has a very unique lure. I pulled this from the book, The Pack Eternal. You used to say that all the time. It's part of an ancient ritual. Once done, we shall be gathered unto one place, never to be cast asunder, united in death as in life, on the hallowed ground of the ritual. I've been working on the hallowed ground part. All this shit, as you call it, is meant to make this place safe for us. Not now. I have a trust that's been set. It will maintain this compound until the end of time. And when I cross over, it will be me and Chloe. And then, one day, you will join us. I've seen them, both of them. Cursed us. The scar binds us to the place of the ritual at death. Mom is here stuck. Dad is out there. That's the mystery. We got him. It's a thermal reading. He's got a heat signature. Working on my last level of exterior protection. Well, what happens then? This is all we've got. And I don't know how long it'll last. We gotta go on the offensive. We can't kill what's been killed. We must banish him. I can't do this, Dad. I can't watch anyone else die. Well, at least Annabelle's away and safe. Where's Brandon? Brandon! Jesus! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Who did this come to on. you? Oh, come on, my mom! Who else did she mark, Brandon? <laughs> dad, she marked my dad. So what happens whenever he kills us, or what happens when we die? Are we gonna be stuck here with him forever? Dad, when did you first start noticing activity outside? When you got here. Didn't you say that the people that were marked would be drawn together? Yes, drawn to where the ritual was performed and to the other members of the bar. My mom did this at home. She did this when I was little at the apartment. 
Hers was performed here. Brandon was living with us while Chloe was here. William was pulled in every different direction. He couldn't fully manifest. Yeah, but now you guys are all in one place. The balance has shifted. He's getting stronger. <laughs> he followed us. Is it reversible? The book talks of a way, but the book. today yeah we got a call from dispatch they said there was a disturbance here is everything all right uh yeah oh, we're having some trouble with the equipment inside uh do you guys want to come in and take a look at it what is that is that blood there's hair yeah, sir stare right there just just is that blood? is that what is that just stay where you are sir just just don't move just jack jack call it in is that a body? Jack, what's over body. there? Jack, call it in. Okay, call it in. Uh, okay, I'm gonna call it. Gonna... Don't move! Uh, Don't you move! Jack, call it in. You were finding the number Get over there! Okay. Take it easy. All right. Take it easy, please. What happened? It's a lot of weird shit. It is hard to explain. You will never believe it. Okay? Just the, the door. The door. Hey. Hey, he's right behind you. He's right there! Just come in. Please. He's right there! He's right there! He's right behind Who's you! Oh my god. Don't don't move! Michael, come in! Come on! Oh, get come back on, in, here. in here! Calm down. What the hell's going on here? Calm down. in these monitors. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This translation is missing, the one about the scars. Dad, where are these pages? I don't. Hey, don't go foggy on me now. This is the most important thing. I didn't lose them. Somebody took them. I've seen those before. These? <laughs> Where? It's a 
It's a ritual. We need to make a circle. That circle is on the floor of the panic room. That's too close quarters for this. But that's in here, and he's out there. Not for long. If this doesn't work, this room is your last holdout. No, Michael, wait. I don't like this idea. I don't want to separate. I should be with you. are in here and besides you don't have the scar and if all hell breaks loose maybe he'll leave you alone because you're not part of the family hey you may be the only thing that saves you brandon you ready not really but i'm in Julia, you holler when you see him break through. Come on, kiddo. Wait, was that him? They're blind. Then don't let me.
Now and forever, I banish you from this bond. Alone you shall wander, bound by this curse, broken from the circle. I shall see you never more. You did good. You put your family first. That's all I ever asked. All I ever wanted to do. I'm proud of you. She 